Have you ever hesitated to open up and speak in public? Yes, bad breath can really play spoil sport. Bad breath can be a confidence buster for many, leaving them both embarrassed and a little helpless. A stinky breath is not just a precursor to social awkwardness, but can be a possible indication to digestive system issues. Bad breath, or halitosis, can be caused due to internal reasons, such as stomach problems or infections of the tonsils, or external causes such as smelly foods, example, onions or garlic, or even habitual smoking. The foul smell keeping you away from people is emitted by a collection of anaerobic bacteria that call the tongue and the insides of the cheeks their home. These bacteria release sulfur, which is the cause of bad breath. So to fight bad breath you can rely on long-term solutions by brushing twice a day, keep you well hydrated or take medications for various infections. The one-stop, efficient answer to bad breath is baking soda. Baking soda is a special composition indeed. It is alkaline and neutralizes the high acidic levels in your mouth that is the cause for bad breath. Since it is not acidic, it causes no harm to the teeth, gums or bones. It kills the bacteria in the mouth that thrive in an environment rich in acidity and sucrose. Best Ways to Use Baking Soda for Bad Breath Baking soda can be used for gargling purposes. Add 1 teaspoon of salt and 1 teaspoon of baking soda to tepid water. Use this as a mouth rinse and remember, do not swallow. Or, you can make a mixture of salt and baking soda, sans water, and rub the insides of your mouth with it. Another solution is to mix 1 teaspoon of baking soda to some apple cider vinegar. Rinse with this and again, do not swallow. It is not poisonous, but it is also not useful if swallowed. For best results rinse, spit, and repeat. For consumption purposes, mix baking soda, 1 teaspoon, with honey, 1 teaspoon, and warm water. Drink this at least once a day for a few days till you feel you are ready to face the world again. Also, remember to keep your diet healthy with the consumption of fresh, green vegetables, pulses and grains. Avoid meats, bread and any kinds of dairy products until the problem of bad breath has receded. Simply drop a whole teaspoon of the powder into water, preferably warm. Allow the powder to fully dissolve and use this in place of the mouthwash. Gargle with the liquid for a good 30 seconds to 1 minute for best results. If time is a constraint or you are not someone who is patient with remedies, simply switch to a toothpaste rich in baking soda. Easily available at most groceries, a paste rich in baking soda will inhibit the growth of bacteria in your oral cavity and thus keep bad breath at bay. Remember that baking soda will not harm your body in any way if consumed in small doses. However, anything in excess can be damaging. Other ways to cure bad breath include regular flossing and tongue scraping, chewing on some cinnamon and then spitting it out, and rinsing with hydrogen peroxide. If bad breath does not recede or becomes offensive, then the problem could be more serious and you may need to consult a doctor as this bad breath could be an indicator to a bigger problem in the digestive system. Baking soda is one ingredient that is always stocked in every household. It helps not just in removing stains, but also in boosting your confidence. Try these many combinations of baking powder for bad breath.
for that million dollar smile.